Hey there, I know we don't all record vocals in the most ideal circumstance, right? So I'm going to share with you a free plugin that you can use to clean up your vocals no matter how bad the noise in the background is. So I'm going to do a couple of tests. Okay, I'm going to record my vocals without the plugin, okay? I'm going to record it dry without the processing. Then I'm going to turn on this fan right here, like just right beside my vocal. When it's turned on, I'm going to then turn on the effects and then we hear the before and the after. Okay, we're going to hear the before and the after to see if this plugin actually works and if it's good enough. And before we go on, I'm not recommending that you keep recording vocals in, you know, less than ideal situations. Typically, you want to record in places that are quiet, that are acoustically treated. But in case you have to run into a situation where, you know, you can't have that um, provided so you can use this plugin to make sure your vocals still stay good. Okay, so... I'm going to go to my mixer in FL Studio to enable my microphone. Okay, so I'm going to come right here. I think this, this is, is the, the mic. mic. Yes. yes. So, so now I'm going, going to, to hit, hit record. record. So this is the vocal recording without the fan on and without the effects on. All right. And now I'm going to put on the fan. I'm pretty sure you can hear the noise of the fan in the background, right? Like it's so obvious. Typically, this should not be possible for you to clean up. But I want to show you that it's actually possible to clean up, okay? So this is still the fan in the background. You can actually, I don't know if you can see the fan spinning, but yeah, it's actually spinning. So I'm going to turn this off. And you can see in FL Studio how big the wave file became even because of the noise, right? So I'm going to stop recording. Okay. Um, turn this off. And let's hear how it sounds. I'm pretty sure you can hear the noise of the fan in the background, right? Like it's so obvious. Typically, this should not be possible for you to clean up. But I want to show you that it's actually possible to clean up. Okay. So this is still the fan in the background. You can actually, I don't know if you can see the fan spinning, but yeah, it's actually spinning. So I'm going to turn this off. Okay, so you can hear the noise, right? So now I'm going to load up the plugin. And this plugin is an AI plugin, it's free, all right? The name of the plugin is called Goyo, Goyo AI plugin. I'm going to try to add a link in the description, okay? So you can just click it and get all you have to do is provide your email and they will send it to your email for you to download, all right? Okay. So now this plugin is pretty easy to use, okay? Now this ambience is really, you know, what you need. If maybe, you know, you have a lot of noise, you can reduce it. So if you want to preserve, for some reason, to preserve some noise in, the, in your vocal, you can increase this. If you work in like movie sets or, you know, some trying to create some artificial dialogue, you can actually, you know, have this. But for me, I don't want any noise in the background. So I'm going to take this all down. And if you have maybe a lot of reverb, maybe your room is echoey, right? You can actually use this to remove echo in your vocal recordings, okay? So I'm just going to leave this here because I don't think I have that issue of echo, okay? So this is the plugin in its default setting. So I'm going to place it right here. I'm pretty sure you can hear the noise of the fan in the background, right? Like it's so obvious. Typically, this should not be possible for you to clean up. Then I'm going to take it all out. Then let's play it again. Sure, you can hear the noise of the fan in the background, right? Like it's so obvious. Typically, this should not be possible for you to clean up. But I'm going to show you that it's actually possible to clean up. Okay. So this is still the fan in the background. Yeah, actually, I don't know if you can see the fan spinning, but yeah, it's actually spinning. So I'm going to show obvious. Typically, this should not be possible for you to clean up. So let's compare this with a premium plugin. Okay, the RX Voice Denoise is a premium plugin that I actually used to clean up vocals before I started using, you know, the Goyo free plugin. So this is how it sounds. Typically, you just leave it in adaptive mode and it automatically does the job for you. So let's see how it sounds. So obvious. Typically, this should not be possible for you to clean up. But I want to show you that it's actually possible to clean up. Okay. So this is still the fan in the background. I'm pretty sure you can hear the noise of the fan in the background, right? Like it's so obvious. You could still actually hear what's going on. Like you could still hear the fan, the wind noise, right? I'm pretty sure you can hear the noise of the fan in the background, right? Like it's so obvious. Typically, this should not be possible for you to clean up. 
I'm going to show you that it's actually possible to clean up, okay? So this is still the fan in the background. You can see no matter how much I try to, you know, clean, clean it up on my own, right? It still has that obvious noise in there. But when I play with the Goyo plugin, the pre plugin, I'm pretty sure you can hear the noise of the fan in the background, right? Like it's so obvious. Typically, this should not be possible for you to clean up. But I'm going to show you that it's actually possible to clean up, okay? So this is still the fan in the background. Actually, I don't know if you can see the fan spinning. And it's so clean that it preserves, you know, the tone, the fidelity in the vocal recording. It doesn't muffle it or make it start sounding artificial like um, the RX Pro voice, the noise. The RX Pro, this plugin is a great plugin, big up to Isoto, but still the Goyo and voice, the noise is so amazing. And the fact that it's free and lightweight on your PC is even more amazing because the RX Pro voice, you know, is going to take up a huge chunk of your CPU resource. So I totally recommend you get this free plugin, at least get it while it's still free and use this to correct and enhance your vocal recordings. If you found this helpful, hit the like button and subscribe for more tips and tricks like this. Iron Man so classy. See you soon. Cheers.